Good afternoon, Samurai. Welcome to the stream, welcome to the channel, welcome to the Vortex. My name is Ezio and I will be your guide this afternoon as we continue our journey into worlds, into realms, into places very much well travelled at this point. Hail Real Spawn and to each and every one of you, welcome. For those of you who could, well, be your chatter, be your lurker, hail and welcome. For those of you who couldn't join us on the previous leg of our journey, we ventured forth across Hyrule. We slew all the electric Lizophos, and now we no longer have to kill electric Lizophos, and for that I am very happy. Hail Hoodlum, welcome. And then we did a bunch more items on the armor list, and now we only have two left. Two left. Mostly requiring star fragments or dragon parts, so this may take some time to actually farm, but we don't have to worry about drop rates. Oh, there may have also been something where we used a duplication glitch to get our way through all of the Zonai stuff, but we won't talk about that. So, I think this afternoon we're going to try and finish up the last two armor sets and finish up all of the recipes, and then it's just nothing but sub-stories, and then we kill Ganondorf, and we never have to play this game ever again. And that will be some form of blessed relief. Hopefully a really good ending though. <laughs> happy Lunar New Year and happy Carnival. Hail Palomino and happy Chinese New Year to you as well. To each and every one of you actually. Um, da -da -da. Or not travelled enough. No, we have not travelled the game enough at this point. But anyway, with that said, come join me as we once more step foot into the vortex as we continue to travel and traverse the world, the realm that is the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Our destination lays before us, the controls are set, and as always, the switch still needs to be turned on, so let's go. Shall we? Boop. Did you listen to Zelda Orchestra? Haven't had the chance. Honestly, have not had the chance. I'll try and do that tomorrow. Great fairy fans, and I think that'll do. Happy New Year! And happy carnival. Indeed. Hail, stray girl. Welcome. Right, where are we going? There we go. Right, finish on the end of the court. Uh, tears of the Kingdom completion. What do we need? We need two Dinral Horn, two Star Fragment, two Shards, oh, ten Shards of Dinral Spike, two Nadral Horn, three Star Fragment, uh, and two Light Dragons. Okay, fun. Where do we begin, however, is the question. Uh, let's start with the Dwagon of Fire. You could have listened while carrying the sofa bed. It would have been an epic adventure. Apart from the fact that I couldn't hear what my mate was telling me as we tried to lug it down a very tight flight of stairs. Also, hail Earth Heart! Yarg, indeed. Water you fall. Water is my main drink at the moment, so cheers. Waifu of the moment. Scald. Am I goddess? Adult version. Easy. Right, onwards. And I find the Dwagon. The Dwagon of Fire. Dwagon known as Dinral. Um. No. Okay. Let us try. Yeah. Let's choose those gamer instincts you have. What gamer instincts that I have? I just sit here, rant, and go, oh, where am I going to go next? Let's try this. Oh, no, that was wrong. I've now fallen off a cliff. If I get lucky, I might even run into the line track. That'll be a novelty. Um... There's a Master Sword. There's a lake. I don't see a Dwagon, so I assume the Dwagon is actually somewhere not here. Probably in the depths at the moment, so that's no use. Well, I mean, I could go into the depths and look for her, but what would be the bleeding point? Um, right, Nadeway. Do I need anything off Nadra? Let's 
Who needs a horn? Uh, no. No, I do not. I just need star fragments. Uh, I need one Dinral horn. And two light dragon horn. Hmm. Okay. So... I need to find the light dragon. I am literally just going to have to warp to every light dragon location on the uh, dragon map, aren't I? Oh, that fills me with a sense of joy everlasting. Right. The instincts are obvious if the okay, wait what? Um Also hell real spawn I oh no I, you were the first person I said welcome to, wasn't it? Uh weren't you? Uh carrying furniture, heavy equipment sucks, and I drop whatever it is breaking it, hurting someone, so thankfully I'm not you. Uh must admit, as heavy as the sofa bed was I still find it much more preferable than the server cabinet I once had to lug halfway across the building I work in. Mostly because it was downstairs and I kept cracking my shins into the sharp metal edges on the <laughs> on the base of it. The sofa bed at least had a, a, a foot that I could grip. It was just a bit awkward going down the stairs. And I'm grateful that we had the idea of taking the photo, the family ancestral portraits off the wall. I'm sure my mum is most disappointed about because they're awful, but still. Uh, but otherwise, they would have ended up smashed at the bottom of the stairs, I suspect. Uh, anyone see a light dragon? Because I don't. And that's kind of a problem. I don't think the Sheikah sensor's powerful enough to crack the light dragon, is it? I mean, I'll give it a try, but... Yeah, first to say hey. Fair enough. Um, because I don't need to track the electrical is off us anymore, do I? Ha 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 ha. Right, okay then. So, we'll work clockwise. So, from here... We need to go... Here. Sorry, I'm only partly paying attention. I'm currently mass-murdering tiny electrical rodents. You're playing Pokemon? Poor Pikachu! Stop murdering! What did Pikachu ever do to you? Unless it's Pichu, in which case, what did poor Pichu ever do to you? Now, if it was Sonichu, then that might be more forgiving. Um, he, he, that, he's classed as an electrical rodent, isn't he? I hate that. I really hate that. <laughs> it's just a little bit too far away for me to warp up. Uh, warp up. So I'm going to have to go here. Yes. Also, mostly Pichu. Won't give me a shiny one, which I can evolve into a surfing badass. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, I have seen a Pikachu 
surfing the guys. I get the feeling I've fallen for that trap once before. Uh. Pichu was a rat to catch in Pokemon Arceus early, so that's why he should be eradicated. Oh, oh ow! Fuck off! Even else, these are alone ones. I've not played the, that's Pokemon. One of them. That's Pokemon Sun and Moon, isn't it? I have yet to play those games. Actually, I've got Pokemon Sword as well, which I have yet to play. Really should get around to it. But then again, I've also got a backlog of Mario Wonder and several other games that I really should play. At the minute, I'm playing a new game plus file of Batman Arkham City because I might be a little bit obsessed at the moment. Right, all that effort for... No light dragons. That's annoying. Okay, fine. Note to self, don't use this warp location again. Just go to the Great Furry. Um, I suppose what I could do is I could just use towers around the length of it and just go up and check and then down again. Also, Legends of Arceus is another game I have yet to finish. I don't know what it is with me in modern Pokemon games, but I just don't really get around to finishing them. Really should at some point. Um... Excuse me. No. Hmm. Dragon a dragon, my kingdom for a dragon. Oh, good. Yep. Right, those sun and moons getting on, so you might want to hurry up if you want to transport those Pokemon to future games. Fair enough. Sun and Moon's on Switch, isn't it? It's not one... Or is it on 3DS? Because I haven't used my 3DS in a long time. No, 3DS. Okay, right. I haven't used my 3DS in a long time. I'm now freezing to death. Um, a quick scout for the dragon. Wait a minute. Yeah, that didn't help. Well, they shut down the transfer ability. I know they, they chose to keep free services, but can't remember what they were. Now, oh, fair enough. The ambassador program, maybe? <laughs> that might be one of them. Doubt it, but... Oh. 
basically the only services that still work, assuming you already downloaded them, are the ones that let you transfer Pokemon from Gen 5 to 6, 7, and then to Switch. Oh, fun. <laughs> Oh, now I remember why I haven't finished Arceus. I was working my way through the subs, through the side quests, and I had to get some ludicrous lead. I had to get something to drop, and I haven't got it to drop yet. And then I got bored and left it. Mm -hmm. but for a dragon that only flies on the surface. Is being an absolute pain in the neck to find. Either that or I'm blind. Um, uh, probably blind to be honest, but. Is it Cher uh, uh, Cherims by any chance? Yes, that's the one. That's our quest dump to lots of people. Yes. I think. I need to load up that game at some point and actually finish it. Stop trying to 100% it. Well, I was yeah, I'm not completing it. I was going to try 100% it, but then I saw... Well, I was going to try and complete it, and then I saw that I had to, like, evolve 10 of the same Pokemon, and I thought, oh, balls to this. I'm not bothering with that. So I'll just go for the Pokedex at level 10 for each of them. Maybe, possibly, don't know. Might even get bored of that at some point. Um, but I clearly have, because I haven't played the game in a very long time. I get the feeling the Light Dragon's going to have to be one of those that I kind of just leave and eventually I'll run into her. Then we're finding a large bruiser, uh, weasel. But that one I did easily, unlike a friend who just had trouble taking him to a spawn. I've done that one. I just had to look up a guide online because I couldn't figure out how to do it. I think that's her. Right, okay, so... Long time. I was having issues finishing the Pokedex because of the mass outbreaks until I remembered that I ain't doing a living dex, so I could just evolve them. Yes. This is a sphere, isn't it? It is. Is it a moving sphere, though? That's the question. Yes, it is. However... There's a dragon right beneath me. Oh, 
There we go. I mean, while I'm at it, I might as well see if there's any light dragon spikes that I can grab. Never mind, there's some. Right, this music's annoying me now. It's on. Nearly 400 hours of hearing that same monster attack music. It, yeah, it is. That must. I must admit, it is starting to grate a little thin. Remember horns? Yeah, I'll get the horns. I just want the spikes. Just to make sure. Well, I think I, I've easily got enough. But if I get enough of them, I can use them as cooking material as well as selling them. Probably not for that much, but you know. Whoop, there we go. Oh. Right, so in 10 minutes she should probably be by Death Mountain or something. So that's all right. We have an idea of where to find her now. Um Oh no, I need to still find Din Mountain. Who knows? Maybe we've killed enough time looking for Zelda that Din Ral has now spawned. Yo oh. No. Suppose we'll find out. Right now. Uh, for example. Or. Dinral is still in the depths, in which case there is no point because I really do not want to go faffing around in the depths looking for Dinral when I can just find her on the surface. Just a, din a fragment of Dinral's horn, isn't it? Yeah. So we need 10 minutes for Zelda to. Well, I'll set a timer going, actually, just so I know how long I need to wait for Zelda. Uh, there we go. So, 10 minutes for Zelda. Do a quick check of our usual two locations for Dinral. Then, after that, I don't know. I suppose we start on the recipe lists because until we've got the second of Dinral's horns. I could... Oh, we need star fragments. I could farm star fragments. Marvelous. I mean, you could just stay on her uh, for the last horn, but I don't know if you could fill ten minutes of just standing there. Probably not, to be honest. So how much more of this game have you got, Ezio? Ten more episodes? Fifty? Three hundred? Probably fifty, given it's me. Um, We have... Two armor sets to finish. Both of which... No, three armor sets. Yeah, two armor sets to finish. Both waiting on us to get dragon parts for the moment. Mainly. We then need to finish up the recipe list of... Um, some recipes. Then we've got all the sub-stories to finish. Then we've got the final boss to fight. And then we've got to hand in the compendium. And find out if we found every location on the map. Hopefully we have... At that point, we finished, and we're on to the next game. The Arkham Origins, I believe. 
so I don't know about five episodes per stream yeah 50 might work pause it man you're wasting time no 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 while I'm unpaused I am burning time on the Zelda respawn aren't I no dragon and thus we can conclude that Dinral's probably still in the depths. So um Arkham Oranges That was that one I couldn't be bothered hundred percent. I will hundred percent it but I won't complete it. Maybe, possibly. I don't know how the challenge maps are. Well, I probably won't actually complete it, because the challenge maps will probably be a bugger. I've certainly given up on my completion of Arkham City for the time being, because so I cannot stand trying to get all of the Riddler trophies on Cat... Uh, stand, not trophies, get all the Riddler challenge medals on Catwoman. I'm just not having fun with it, so I've dropped that. I'll do New Game Plus, because I love the story of Arkham City, but... Yeah, still not doing wrong. Right, okay, back to farming then. I love the city in Ar uh, the story of Arkham City, so I will replay it on New Game Plus. Also, thanks to all the combat challenges, I've got quite good at the combat mechanics in, the, in that game. But uh, other than that, yeah, I, I I burnt out. If it was just the base game, I'd have I'd have I'd have gone for completion, but I I'd have to go through all finish off all the predator challenges for Catwoman, which are not really fun. I'd have to then go off and do all the campaign challenges for Catwoman, which is just basically doing com a mixture of combat and predator challenges with restrictions or bonuses, which I don't feel like doing. And, well, I really don't because I really hate the Catwoman pro predator missions because of her lack of gadgets. Then I'd have to go and do the exact same thing with Robin. So all the combat challenges, all the predator challenges, and all of the ca uh, campaign challenges. And then I'd have to do the same process of combat, predator, and campaign with Nightwing. No. Just just maybe one day I'll come back to it and try it, but for the moment, no. Cannot be bothered. Really, really cannot be bothered. Oh, hit. Right. Oh, wait, Arkham Orange. Oh, I'm going to blast Arkham Oranges now, right? Arkham Orange. That's, that's broken me now. Right. Arkham Origins. There we go. I probably won't fully complete because you have to play I Am The Night mode and that doesn't sound like fun. Especially with the Bane fight. Oh yeah, I got the last three tails. We have done all the Electric Lizophos now. We don't have to do a single Electric, Liz electric Lizophos for the remainder of ever because we've done it. That's it. No more tails required unless one's needed for a recipe and I will be very annoyed, but I don't think there are. I remember how many star fragments I've got. I think I've already got three, so I just need to get three more and then we've done that as well. Don't have to get any more opals as well. This is a nice plus. Nope. Oh, right, no spawn on this one. There you what? I think I can probably get rid of these stamps as well. Just to clear up the map a bit.
Did you say wife of the moment? Yes, earlier, when Earthfart redeemed it. I've just realised I'm being really dumb here because I'm getting rid of all my electric Zopos stamps and I might need one later. Oh well, too late now. There we go. All of them cleared off the map. Keep... Why have I marked that with a star? Oh, it's a stable. Right, that'll be a sub story. What are you for? Here's that part. For the record, I've got water in my main glass this, uh, for the first part. Just remembered I've left my bottle open on the other side of the room. Blast. Because once I finish that water, I've got a bottle of beer here to work through. But I'm going to try and leave that a little longer. Yep. So I still have something to drink towards the end of the stream. Ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. Bomb. Okay, now that's three star fragments now. Oh, well, right, so we need three more. Well, now that we've found our rhythm, we can easily get three more. So what's the term I want you for? Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> Good question though, what is the timer? Manage rewards. Uh, what the dickens is story time? Oh, four sets yo to play the story, right. Um What are you fool? Seven minutes reading. I don't know why I put seven minutes, but there we go. It's a, it's a seven minute timer. Uh, Six ish minutes? Yeah, seven minutes. Uh, I need to wait by a campfire. Wait. Where is the four sets here to play the story? Uh, have I turned it on? Oh, I've not turned it on. Never mind. Oh, that's ten minutes. Marvelous. Come to think of it, 999,999 points seems a bit low for that one. I'll get the star fragment from this tower and then we'll go off and find Zelda again. Maybe it should be 999,000... No, no, no. 9,999,999. That seems a bit better. This changes everything. Why did they change everything? Basically forces me to play the story for a stream. And then once I finish the story, you're stuck watching me just do all the post-game stuff. Forever. Is that really a good thing? Well, I suppose people just tune out and do something else while I wrap up all the post-game stuff, but still. I think there is a very good reason why I've never enabled that one. Assuming that is what I think it is. 
story time. Yeah, four sets of you to play nothing but the story for the rest of the stream. For 999,999. Um, which, yeah, given the amount of people who don't spend points here, that that's probably easily achievable by most people here. So maybe not. Right. We'll have a Dinral or we'll have a Zelda. Um... Neither. Do we think... Zelda, right, where was Zelda last time? She was... Somewhere around here. I think. No, somewhere down here. Hmm. Or was she up here? Oh. Uh... I cannot remember, is the honest answer. Oh dear. Uh... Mm. Right, I've lost Zelda again. Well, you do all the post-game stuff anyway before the final boss, and your companion and your compulsion to do so, and not being able to, uh, would drive you mad. Well, yes, or well, make me annoyed. Uh, going into the final battle, not at max level, or have the best weapons armor. That's just not you, is it? No. He still has to take pictures for, and turn them in, which he'll do if he realises he still hasn't gotten every location. Yes, but I won't know if I've got every location until we've got to the post-game, because the game doesn't tell me whether or not i found every location until the post-game. And it won't tell me which ones I've missed either. Oh, I've already been here. Okay. Uh, it won't tell me which ones I've missed either, which is rather annoying. Um... I mean, I can fly fast, it seems. Ah, come on. Right, well, we know she isn't in this area because we've already flown past, so maybe she's around here. But well, yes, we need three more pictures, and then we... Well, three more pictures for the compendium, because we've already bought all the other ones. You should give up give up whiskey for Lent. Hmm. No whiskey redeem for Lent. Not alcohol, but just whiskey. I, mean, I could. I think I've done that before, actually. I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. Um, also give up chocolate. That might be a bit healthier. Uh, Anyone see a dragon? Next week. Hey, oh, last minute continue. Hey, old Kev, and cheers. I see no dragon. This annoys 